Hello and welcome to Talking Toffee. This is one of the only places on YouTube for Evertonians to get together and discuss all things Everton. Um, now, first of all, I've got to hold my hands up and say, you know, I haven't put a vlog together for a few weeks. In fact, the last vlog I put together was, uh, it jinxed the Le Leroy Fur deal. Um, I put a vlog together and then uploaded it. It uploaded in the morning then and I went on Twitter and I realised that we uh, the deal had collapsed because uh, the guy had bad knees and uh, a few people have blamed me and said you you jinxed it talking toffee so if I have then I hold my hands up um, but for whatever reason Everton didn't feel that they wanted to splash out on Leroy Fair he went away transfer window slammed shut um, and we failed to really bring any notable um, notable players in apart from the young lad from Barnsley who might be going back to Barnsley now on loan I think it's John Stones uh, so yeah apart from that you know we uh, didn't really bring him in but I prefer to look at things a little bit on the on the positive side and we didn't lose Baines, we didn't use for, lose Fellaini so there's a plus, maybe I've got low expectations but for me that's a plus so since then obviously uh, I've had a few games, notably last week uh, the 3 old draw with Villa now I took a mate of mine who's a neutral to Goodison on Saturday, um, came with me, had a, a spare ticket and yeah no, he, he came and he thought he was brilliant because he was at 6 goals but I was a little bit worried with us defensively and that worries kind of snowballed throughout the week because the more I think back on how poor we were at the back against Aston Villa, against a poor Aston Villa side as well, then I realised we've got to go to Manchester United on Sunday, um, a place where we haven't won since I was like two. Um, 1990 was the last time we went and won there. Normally we roll over and get battered at, at Old Trafford. It's, it's quite evident that is. But last time uh, we went to Old Trafford, we drew 4 all, which was a terrific game, a game I did... Uh, Fan zone four on Sky Sports really enjoyed that good good game to do it as well. And this fixture at Goodison earlier on in the season, well the first game of the season for us um, on a Monday night it was. Um, Fellaini scored and Everton won one 0 Now if that happens again tomorrow, I've put a bet on as you can see. Here we go, is the bet. If that happens tomorrow and Everton do go on to uh, to win one 0 and Fellaini does in fact score again as he did. Against Manchester United here. Um, what I'll do is I will split the winnings. I put three pound on. I will split the winnings uh, with uh, one person who um, shares this video by uh, via Twitter. So, for example, if you um, retweet this video on Twitter and Fellaini scores against Manchester United tomorrow, and we go on to win one nil, I will pick one person who who are tweed uh, are tweed. I invented that. RT the video, and I will share the winnings with you. So. Um, Give me your thoughts and your opinions on, on the game on Sunday. Who are you going to pick defensively? What we'll focus on is the defensive aspect of the side. So, for example, are you going to keep uh, the same system as we had against against uh, the Villa? So that would mean John Heiting at, at full-back and, and Jagielka moved out uh, to right-back. Would you exchange those two and, and, and move Heisinger out to right-back maybe and bring Jagielka into the centre? Or would you bring Phil Neville in at right-back? Now, Neville, Norm, and drop Heisinger to the bench, by the way. Would you would you do that? I mean, David Moyes normally likes to play um, Phil Neville in the middle against Manchester United, or he has done uh, the last few times we've played them, if I recall. So what would you do? Try and get inside David Moyes' head and let me know what you think you'd do. Uh, so as I said, you know, if you retweet this video, um, then I will share the, the winnings of that bet with you, with one person uh, that I pick out from the people who've, who've, art, who've, who've RT'd. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. This is Talking Toffee. Come on, you blues.